good morning, uh, good good, uh, good uh, uh, afternoon, rather. I uh, I have a question for you um, uh, uh, regarding this this very difficult days. What is the Greek industry uh, with, uh, afraid of? Uh, we have long term uh, agreements with stable uh, power prices for three uh, four years. Uh, the uh, the tariffs tariffs are are, are um, closed. Um, um, why is uh, so much uncertainty on all levels? So why uh, are consumers and end users feel so much uncertainty? First of all, thank you very much for the opportunity. Um, uh, giving us to participate. It's very interesting discussion. I have um, um, actually uh, been feeling very uh, uh, pleased uh, to hear a lot of uh, um, uh, God's truth today, uh, which of course um, uh, have been something that we experts have been, uh, I mean, reiterating for many many years. As you know very well. 90% uh, of the production in Greece is exported. So what we are interested in is uh, to have a competitive cost um, versus the Germans, the Italians and the Spanish. The, the Spanish. We are not talking about our, our neighbours, Turkey, because we cannot compare with them. But um, what decides whether we have a, uh, a, um, an affordable cost is the operation of the Greek market. And unfortunately, the Greek market, due to structural problems, is not uh, competitive. These structural problems have been actually uh, have been uh, a, uh, have been known to us, and unfortunately, our industry is now paying the cost of the crisis. Uh, our small industry is at the, uh, let's say, at the center of a, a storm. We unfortunately do not have the the, the ability and the means to, 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 to do hedging or long-term agreements and that is why we are paying the cost uh, and we are exposed to enormous risks because when medium voltage, medium voltage um, uh, is uh, it, it has been uh, 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 let's say has to face uh, with a um, let's say terminate termination of all the contracts uh, during the second uh, uh, quarter of uh, uh, 2021, which of course has been already exposed by us to the uh, independent authority and we requested uh, uh, measures to be taken. Uh, the One of the previous speakers told today, said before that uh, um, uh, uh, the current prices has win have wind for profits. This is a very important conclusion. When we say that renewable energy resources are the solution, we should also have it very clear in our head and we are uh, for uh, uh, energy transition that uh, uh, we uh, have already, uh, we are already ready, and we are already planning for the um, for the future based on renewable energy resources. Uh, we uh, 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 participate in all efforts. There is no question of whether we are going fast or slow. And very soon, you are going to see uh, in uh, practice what how we are doing. But unfortunately, the market in Greece uh, does not support us. Uh, unfortunately, uh, right now, we, we started from a monopoly and we are now um, with an oligopoly in our hands. Um, a, uh, a, a, a bilateral contract requires two parties. We can't have a bilateral contract with just one uh, party. So right now, in the Greek market, there is no uh, possibility for us to hedge. And uh, not by us, not by small suppliers. Uh, on the contrary, uh, for the four big um, producers, uh, do not worry. 
uh, whether they are going to uh, a, well sell uh, their uh, production because uh, uh, instead of giving us long-term co contracts they do other things we are uh, used to taking risks this is our work we are taking uh, we are going we are going on long-term contracts and we hedge what we can but in Greece, the only possibility to hedge is to go to the European uh, Stock Exchange, which, of course, uh, has certain limits for the Greek market. Of course, therefore, we're open to green cottons, but unfortunately, uh, the, the uh, conditions today are not uh, uh, favorable. Um, uh, we, uh, renewable energy resources uh, are right now um, uh, well, uh, turning towards the public, we uh, actually know that uh, uh, the uh, calls for tender will continue until 2025. But uh, if there are no incentives, or if you want your you want debt deterrence. Uh, for uh, stable to achieve stable tar uh, tariffs for renewable energy source of produced uh, power, uh, because we have uh, various types of costs that are inherent to renewable energy sources, um, there are going to be there's going to be difficulties. We are ready to um, to play, but we cannot play by ourselves. And uh, let me say something about the European Commission. The European Commission has just issued a toolbox, which of course um, uh, has, uh, uh, ignores the fact that, that uh, um, uh, the markets in Southern Europe are not the same as those in, uh, in Northern in Europe. For example, the, that energy here goes uh, through uh, the, the wholesalers. Uh, uh, the Greek wholesalers. So when Spain went on to um, um, uh, enforce a, an, an obligatory 62% uh, daily um, uh, supply uh, uh, on renewable energy sources, it already knew that already knew that. Uh, uh, it, it realized what the professor said, that we have to find the ways to uh, 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 well, pass on the uh, uh, mean uh, uh, con consumption cost on to uh, the consumer. I think that you have already uh, been quite concise, but because we don't have very much time, I would like you to comment or on rather I would like a, a, a few comments or very brief comments on the remaining uh, uh, speakers. Well, I need some time because I, I haven't had time to and I did speak less than the others. So uh, one, two, uh, one, two uh, sentences please, not more. Can I open my presentation? I think that the question today is um, who will um, uh, pay the cost of the, of the current crisis? This crisis will, will actually uh, return, will, uh, will be recurrent. Um, and uh, it, of course, affects investments. Investments have uh, uh, gone down, uh, sharply down, and therefore this affects the costs of natural gas. Now that uh, all the uh, contracts are uh, with a variable market cost, um, it means that there's no risk at all for retail. So as producers, uh, they can uh, uh, save the cost uh, at the level of wholesale and obviously to make profits. Um, uh, Winds on profits 39%, as the professor said. Um, have we the necessary technology for green transition? Obviously no. 
uh, do we have the necessary resources in Greece? We don't even have the possibility to store uh, natural gas. Um, so uh, the the so-called 50 to 55. Um, uh, it includes also, uh, to a considerable extent, the so-called electrification of the uh, uh, of the market. So, which uh, is which co company will uh, and which economy will uh, will uh, invest in electrification? Uh, there are gaps in uh, every strategy. And in every method, we think that uh, the five-party uh, um, five agreement that was recently signed, signed and, uh, is a very good idea. Uh, the professor has already said the rest. I don't think that I, am, I, I have anything to add, but you will... Uh, also see how the European industry centers will uh, respond to recent developments. CO2 uh, levels have to be uh, controlled and, you, and, and will be controlled and we will not have excessive increases. I have to be uh, strict because we don't have time. I think that you have already said, well, uh, uh, what was to be said. Uh, for, we could be speaking for hours and end. We all know that, but well, uh, the industry will again have to call to pay the cost, and of course, the, 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 the losers will be the consumers. Okay, this is what I would like to uh, uh, well uh, keep from what you have said and from this very interesting discussion we have to go fast on we have gone go, have to rush on to uh, green uh, a energy i think there's no doubt about that we need a more competitive market we have win for profits windfall and profits we um, uh, need to uh, um, uh, well uh, correct any distortions uh, in the market we need to understand that, that uh, marginal prices are, uh, are not something uh, or purely conjectural and that they will be with us also in the coming years and that is why we need to offset um, uh, to offset these increases by uh, 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 with bilateral contracts uh, in following uh, for example the example of the Germans or generally the example the example of Europe where um, uh, 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 part goes through the stock exchange and the rest, the rest of the energy goes uh, through bilateral uh, uh, agreements and of course storage is a big issue um, and the question is when are we going to, to have this framework, this famous framework um, uh, which of course uh, we hope uh, will um, uh, happen, will uh, be established in Greece uh, soon. Uh, I would like to thank our distinguished uh, speakers and uh, wish them um, good luck.